Max has $125 consisting of bills, each worth either $5 or $20. How many bills worth $5 does Max have? So let's spend a minute exploring this prompt before we move on to the questions. What are some possibilities? Well, the most straightforward possibility is if he had six 20s and one five but he could change out one of those 20s. Suppose he reduced the number of 20s by one, so he had five 20s, he had $100 in 20s. Well, then he, for the missing 20, he'd have to add four $5 bills, so this would move up five. And again, if this went down one, this would have to go up four. If this went down one, this would have to go up four. So we have a few possibilities here. So now let's leave this and move on to the statements. Statement number one tells us that Max has fewer than five $5 bills. Well, so it means that none of these cases work, and the only one that works is the case where he has one $5 bill and six 20s. And so this is actually sufficient for answering the question by itself. Statement number one, sufficient. So now ignore statement number one. Turn to statement number two. Max has more than five bills of 20s. He has more than five 20s. So in other words, having five 20s and any of these others, that's not going to work. The only possibility that's going to work is having six 20s. And so again, this statement by itself narrows it down to a single possibility, so this statement is sufficient. Both statements sufficient, answer choice D.